Hey guys, American Chip here with, uh, well, I would say my Asus G46 VW. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. Well, it's not going to say G46 VW on it, but this is the model of it. Well, um, this laptop has 8 gigs of RAM, 2.6 quad-core processor, and a bunch of other features like the 660M from NVIDIA. And it comes pre-installed with the Windows 8. And I know a lot of people don't like Windows 8. So, I've been searching the ROG forums on downgrading this laptop to Windows 7. And well, um, basically a bunch of people say that you can't find the drivers for it. Or it would even brick your laptop. Well, I'm here to prove that wrong. Well, here you go. Bam. Oh, I'm still installing an update. But as you can see, I'm on Windows 7 Ultimate, and I have basically every driver. Well, I've had Windows 7 Ultimate for like, this, this is going on the third day. And as you can see, every, everything's fine. Once this update finishes, I'll bring it back. Alrighty, so my update's finished. Let's uh, boot up in this sucker. Bam. Booting. Keyboards up. Republic of Gamers. Intel processor. And... Starting Windows. Oof. Sorry about that. But yeah, as you can see, I successfully installed the Windows 7 on a Windows 8 or 8.1 computer only. And I know a lot of people like Windows 7 better than Windows 8 for many features. Even though, in my opinion, Windows 8 can be faster because it uses less resources than Windows 7. But that's besides the point. As you can see, it's booting up. It's my little mouse in the middle. My eyes. Welcome on Windows 7 Ultimate. Oof. I'm just literally just waiting for it to get to the desktop. And if you guys look in the description, I'll go over it briefly on how to install Windows 7 on this. But um, if you guys look in the description, I'll have some, not all drivers, but some of the drivers. And, um, oh well, yeah, because I know I haven't gotten all of them. And some of them aren't even compatible, like, I think the USB 3.0 controller, I don't think you could find that one online. I'll still look, and I'll update the description whenever I can, but I'm not sure you can. So, you guys see, I am, in fact, on Windows 7 Ultimate. Bam. MS Info 32. Let's just wait for this to start up. I think it's loading up everything. It's a fresh install of Windows 7. So you see, I have Microsoft Windows 7 Ultimate, Service Pack 1. That's my that's my name if you guys didn't know. The system name right there. Um, Asus Tech Computer, G46 VW, with an i5-3230. 2.6 gigahertz processor, yada yada yada, yada. Bam. And, well, yeah, this is Windows 7. There's nothing else really to it. I'll show you some of the uh, device drivers I haven't found. Device manager. It's very awkward typing with one hand. Bam. Uh, these are some of the things. I haven't gotten my Ethernet drivers. Oh yeah, that also reminds me. When you guys install Windows 7, you won't have your Wi-Fi drivers. So you're going to have to manually find that. And I would recommend finding it before you actually install Windows 7. Uh, my chipset drivers, I believe. And the USB 3.0 controller. Everything else, such as my... HD Graphics 4000 and GTX 660 is fine. 
my two hard drives oh yeah this also comes with the second hard drive slot so it has an M SATA slot and it has the regular HDD so if anything you could put like a one tel a terabyte um, M SATA drive although that would be very expensive or you could go more logical with the 128 M SATA SSD but that's completely up to you guys and these are really the only three drivers I have not found everything else I have found and those will be found down in the description but yeah everything seems fine it's completely stable it hasn't really taken a crap on itself or at least yet this is my fifth or fourth or third day I don't really keep track the only bad thing is I lost everything so I have to reinstall every single program I had yada 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 it's, it's, it's a struggle oh yeah my steam <laughs> bam alrighty thank you guys for watching like comment and subscribe if you have questions just leave them down in the comment section I'll try to get every driver I downloaded for the computer onto the description so you guys can see it but other than that I'll see you guys next time Bye-bye.